In this video, we're going to cover the new Open Edge chip card uh, reader interface. Um, in this interface, the uh, credit card processing is handled completely by Open Edge, and therefore Lizzie is not involved in the collection of the credit card data or the processing of the data. So the, the entire interface works uh, completely different than the rest of the program used to work. So if you're using the new chip card process, um, it, it can get a little tricky um, with users doing different things and getting confused and not processing cards when they're supposed to or uh, saying they process cards when they really didn't. And so to, to help uh, research some of these problems, what we did is we've actually started tracking exactly what is going on in that payment, payment process. And so in this video, I'm gonna cover the, the new uh, module that we added to help diagnose some of the problems that you may be having. So if you're using the new Open Edge chip card readers, um, you're going to notice down here at the bottom in the totals pay section where you've got your payment details, you're gonna notice a new Open Edge icon sitting here. When you click on that icon, you can see, before I click the icon, you can see that this card was processed through uh, the system uh, it has all of its numbers here. So you've got your authorization numbers and things that are showing up. You've got your amount. Um, you know that here that it's already been deposited into the checkbook and so forth. But if we click on the actual uh, uh, icon here, what we can see is that we had the user add this credit card to the system. They did not process it. Um, they did have it flagged to use through or to have Lizzie use the uh, pr or do the processing. We have the amount. We have that the user removed that payment. So they actually went in, added the credit card, but they never actually hit the pay button that, or the process button. So they deleted it off of the invoice. Um, so you can see, you know, there is no transaction number, no bank confirmation number. But then they turned around and added the credit card back to the, the payment screen again. This time we have a, a transaction number. We know which user actually processed the card. We can see here that it actually did get processed. It was flagged for Lizzie to process it. The user did not remove this one and it was not declined. And then we also have the bank confirmation number here for that particular credit card. So this new control actually gives you quite a bit of uh, information about that particular process so that you can go in yourself and, and research exactly what happened on that payment screen related to your credit cards.